Hi, welcome to Fairy Moon Tarot and your daily collective reading for today, June 15th. Is it the 15th? Yes, the 15th. Yes. Ooh, okay, is that 2.34 on the clock? You are on the right path. All right, let's go ahead and jump in and see what messages Spirit has for us today. Messages from a beautiful collective, please, Spirit. What do we need to be aware of? Ooh, got the flag. Do not be tempted to lower your standards. So maybe needing to watch out for red flags in a situation even. Whenever I see that flag, I always think red flag. So pay attention to any kind of red flags that Spirit is saying. Do not be tempted to lower your standards, right? We know there's haters out there lurking and shit, but you know, let it just let it go. Table, hard work ahead. So there's some kind of hard work ahead here. Interesting, but do not be tempted to lower your standards. Ah, hell. If you're hurting for money, don't go doing nothing you wouldn't normally do. I just say what I hear, okay? Okay, so we have matters of the heart. Matters of the heart. Okay, so you maybe have dealing with somebody here. This fair man. Now, this could be with this honor and respect will come to you. This could be a judge. This could be a lawyer. Or you're dealing with this fair man, okay? Dealing to relationship with a man with blonde, gray, or white hair. But we have the teardrops here. Great personal sorrow. Great personal sorrow. There is hard work ahead, but do not be tempted to lower your standards here because the honor and the respect will ultimately come to you. You hold the crown, but this has something to do with matters of the heart, love, deep affection, and caring. So someone that you love and, and care for. Yeah, so this could be anybody, friend, lover, family member, you know. So yeah, something to do, I knew it. Thank you, spirit, financial punch, okay? So <laughs> do not be tempted to lower your standards. I see that table in that freaking pole there. I I'm, don't, I just, I just say what comes to me, y'all. All right? Don't be tempted to lower your standards just because you're going through hard hard times here, all right? There's other things to do. All right. But I almost feel like some of you guys, um, uh, something to do with this man. Now, this could, like I said, this could be a separation maybe you're going through with somebody here. And this could be like the lawyer or the judge or whatever the case may be here. Um, let's see. So... Money or property through an inheritance, winning or windfall. Money or property through an inheritance, winning or windfall. So yeah, this is like that separation and like the court shit and like the getting this money and this property here. Okay, matters of the heart though. Matters of the heart. Interesting. Okay, so let's go ahead and see what's going on here. Single. Current status, single and available. Yeah, I feel like there is like a separation taking place. Cricket, silence, non-action. Time to act, I saw with the lion. Time to act. Okay, so there is, there is. Sorrow over a loss with a wreath and great personal sorrow. Some of you guys, this could be the loss of like an LEO. Like say you have somebody in your family. Um, now this could be a lot. You, there could have, there could literally be the loss of somebody here, right? There could be. Um, with this flag and the honor and the respect and all this sorrow and sorrow over a loss with the wreath. I'm picking up like um, the loss of like someone who was of service of somehow in regards to legalities. LEOs, you know, law enforcement, military, something like that. It's like the flag. It's like, you know, when they lower the flag. So that's for some of you. Okay. Um, some of you guys have lost this loved one. And uh, this was like your husband or something. Okay. Money or property through an inheritance, winning or windfall. So this is like an inheritance from this death. Um, so you may be having a financial pinch here. And there may be some hard work ahead. Um, but 
you're going to have this windfall come in here. And then there's this dealings relationship with a woman and time to act though. Time to act. So I don't know what this time to act is. But there's this non-action card here and this silence. Interesting. Maybe you've gone through this death already. Maybe this has already happened. Um, and you have your, maybe you're this man that's going in this sorrow. Maybe you lost this woman. And uh, maybe you've been, uh, maybe you have this opportunity for this love here, but you're still kind of mourning this last, this loss. And maybe Spirit's saying it's time to act. Like, um, and I, I, I'm not trying to say that anybody should just get over it and move on. That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying that you may be still be mourning this loss, but you have this opportunity here for love. Okay. So that's for some of you. Others of you guys, maybe you're just going like literally through like a divorce here. Okay. Let's see. Messages for my collective, please. We got the online searching. Online searching, looking for information and records. Hmm. So you could be online looking for a new job. You can be online looking for like a house, a place to stay, um, to rent or anything like that. Uh, maybe you're online on the little, maybe you're on been on these little um, dating sites even, or someone, you know, something. <laughs> online looking for information though. Hmm. But single. Got this magnetic pole on the bottom of the deck here. Unexplainable pole, can't resist. Toned in, internet connected, online. Acts. There's something. Someone's got their eye on somebody anyway. Someone's looking online. Okay, so some of y'all, you caught your person online acting single, looking on these single sites, maybe even hooking up with people here. Um, and maybe you're the one that's done. We're done here. We're done. Completion. Lesson learned. Becoming single because somebody third party bounty hunter, chaser, hot pursuit of these little love affairs. Mmm, yeah, someone gonna be moving out here or something like that. Or getting thrown out. Someone gonna be getting thrown out here. <laughs> oh shit. Ah oh, shit. Okay then. So there is a buying and selling of a home, a property or something, but it's like we see this money or property through an inheritance winning or windfall so got this chemistry sidetrack yeah someone gets distracted easily i feel like so someone was definitely cheating in a situation that's what i feel like there's something going on either way you wear this crown the, car, the honor and respect is ultimately going to be coming to you spark chemistry passion desire Magnetic pole, can't resist. Looking online, little love affairs, bounty hunter, chaser, but someone, we're done, sold, moving, physical location change. Someone gets distracted easily. This is someone who's always in the search, like looking for excitement and shit, I feel like, right? Um, but this is this passion, this desire, fireworks here. There's something. <sighs> we'll see. Someone online acting single, looking for this passion. You know what I mean? It's what it looks like to me. Yeah, in a commitment. Yeah. But this person is this is dishonest, elusive, tricky. Dealing with a little trickster here. 
in this in this relationship in the, in this commitment. Yeah, elusive loss and resentment, grief, sorrow, pain, sorrow, great personal sorrow, and sorrow over a loss dissatisfaction with life with the cracked cup now that's a broken cup there cups represent emotion heart okay it uh, there's been yeah so it's like when it's like this it's like the stages of grief here right because we go through the sorrow and the grief and the pain but then it turns into anger and you know bitterness even sometimes with loss Okay, so this could, I mean, at this point, you could go either way, all right, with the loss part. But it, it almost seems like this is just the loss of, like, a relationship because someone was, it looks like cheating. Yeah, unconditional love. So there's that broken heart. So here's this heart, unconditional love, yes, and then shattered, the broken cup. Damaged, broken hearted, destroyed. Because why? Because someone was exploring their options. Roman. Lusty, non committal. <laughs> Repeating the same karmic patterns. Someone's got a lot, you know, someone's not learning their lesson. But someone's going to be, someone's learning. Someone's waking up. Matter of fact, that came flying out in the pre shuffle was the awakening card. Someone's learning a lesson, though. Someone keeps repeating the same negative bullshit. Hmm. Yeah, because this person, this person is elusive because they get distracted easily. It's like they're very inconsistent, in and out, because they are always on the hunt. They're always on the roam. They're, they're one day they're talking to this person, the next day they're talking to this person, the next day they're talking to that person. It's just. That's what I'm getting. This person just, it's weird. There goes the star. The honor and the respect will come to you. This is a blessing, right? Aquarian energy. It's healing energy. There's going to be a need to heal here, right? The star is being called to your purpose as well. It's being guided. It's, it's inspiration. Yes. But healing energy. wish being granted yep old sneaky yeah you're dealing with a trickster here elusive liar thief cheater so oh god at this point you can go either way masculine you either have someone who has been lying and sneaking and thieving and cheating and whatever behind your back here, or it's the masculine. It doesn't really matter. Just get it how it fits your situation, y'all. But I see dealings with a man. Now, this could, like I said, this could be a business partner, a coworker, you know, a, a, a friend, a family member. Uh, either way, so I could still be speaking to a masculine who's dealing with this other masculine who is, you know what I mean? There could have been a loss because, okay, the emperor is what? I mean, he can represent a person in a position of high authority. He's respected. Yes, he's achieved. But he also can represent like um, like a, a military. Someone, I'm telling you. So there's something going on here. And then you have this fucker running off with a knife in his hand. So there could have been like the actual loss here. You know? Cause that's some shady ass shit that dude running away with the knife thinking he gonna get away with some shit and we have all this tears and sorrow and loss of what i say something to do with law enforcement military okay so this is also someone who maybe is like abusing their power right it's a liar it's a liar but um someone definitely is being tricky and elusive and um Playing fucking games here. The emperor is sitting in the challenge. Which tells me it's most likely this emperor that someone's dealing with. This man who 
as being non-committal, cheating, okay? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because husband, husband, wife. Got the masculine to the feminine energy. So at this point, it could really, really go either way. All right. I, and, and this has been coming up in my readings as well. You know, there's either a masculine who's been cheating and got someone knocked up or there's been a, 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 a feminine cheating on a masculine and she's knocked up. And it's like, who the daddy? But you're married to this person that. <laughs> whew. Mother, father, masculine to a feminine. Mars, Venus, energy. Being tricky, tricky, tricky. So either way, the honor and respect will come to you because the emperor and the empress are both very well respected. Yes? Hmm. Let's keep going. There goes uh, temperance. Temperance. Peace, balance, harmony, hope. You know, this is more to do with like this healing energy. Star, at, yeah, there's divine guidance, divine protection here. You literally have him. This is literally balancing out the masculine to the feminine energy, the moon to the sun, the, the, the yin to the yang, the light to the dark, the masculine to the feminine here. Um, but it's all about patience as well. We'll see what clarifies them, but yeah, this is there's divine guidance here for sure. Six of Pentacles. Okay, so this is a fucking fraud. It's a thief. This is someone who takes advantage. There, this here is all about balance or something to do with the balance here, the give and take, the equality. Um, you know, I thought I was seeing the scales some damn where, but no, I was wrong. I was wrong. Control. Okay, yes. Control your anger or you will be sorry. It's like something might have get... Oh, God. This was coming up last night in my reading. And I think it was the air sign reading. Y'all, this control your anger card was showing face yesterday in the air signs mid-month reading. And... Whew. There is some shit going on. I do not like this person here plotting, scheming, sneaking around with this knife in his hand and all this sorrow over a loss. Like, people are acting crazy right now. And it's this fucking um, love triangle type of situations. And people are losing their minds. Um, and this control your anger or you will be sorry. Do not be tempted to lower your standards here. Okay, um, because it's almost like someone's going to find some shit out and they're going to just lose their shit. And when I say lose their shit, I mean lose their shit. Like someone's going to get hurt, lose their shit. Um, and air signs, for those of you who watched your reading. After I pushed stop, I was digging down deeper into the deck like I usually do. And I come across the five of swords. The Seven of Swords, the Knight of Swords, and the Ten of Swords, and I want to say the Four of Swords. I, I can't quite remember, but it was a whole bunch of swords, and it was all the bad ones. I mean, that, that Knight of Swords is basically like this person in here, rushing in with their weapons drawn. You got the Ten of Swords, you got the Five of Swords, and it's interesting because in this particular deck, in that five of swords there's like literally a blood trail so and we had all this control your anger whoo it's like someone gonna find some shit out and they really gonna want to react in a not good way because someone is what stealing thieving frauding i don't know giving to two right begging begging some of y'all you're dealing with someone who makes you beg for your time energy attention even you know what i mean with this six of pentacles but that this could be these negotiations regarding um this the separation even this is like that same energy so if y'all are going through a separation <sighs> there's someone working against you behind your back Right? In regards to what? The money and shit? 
I, 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 that was coming up heavy, heavy, heavy in air signs reading yesterday as well with the, with the woman and then we had the rat next to the bat next to the, I mean, it was all right there. Someone, you know, is working against you, a two faced friend. Whew. We'll see though. But this is this honor and respect will come to you getting uh shit. <laughs> That's the six of wands. Whew. Either way, you're gonna get what you what you deserve here with the six of pentacles. This is also being in this financial pinch right now. You really need to balance out your checkbooks, moderate your spending, okay? Um, I just don't like this next to the seven of swords. That's a fucking thief, man. It's a fraud. Being taken advantage of. Judgment. Crowning the spread. Yeah. Facing judgment. Someone thinks this is like trying to avoid accountability, avoid judgment, avoid the truth here. Um, this is this judgment in court as well. Some of you guys maybe even having to pay out a bunch for lawyers and shit. Uh, but this is like receiving. I'm telling you. Money or property through an inheritance, winning or windfall. Okay. Dealing's relationship with the woman and time to act. I'm not. So this, like I said, this could be a whole new woman here. Some of y'all may be a person dealing with this shit. Hell, I don't know. But. Let's keep going. It's also forgiveness and second chances, surrendering and releasing. So we'll see how it all plays out. But five of pentacles, mourning a loss, being kicked out. what I say? Someone could literally be getting thrown out. Because <laughs> um, this is like, the, with, this, with the five and the six of pentacles, that's just financial punch. This is financial hardship. It's need, in need of assistance and guidance. I'm telling you, spirit is going to bless you. This is unexpected help arriving right money or property through an inheritance winning or windfall or like you invested in this person right all this money inherit you know this property and bought home together and now there's you know what i mean now you're oh god but this is this is his loss every time i see this table and shit and with the moving and stuff yeah there's definitely gonna be like a moving out or being thrown out because this could be like homelessness this could be getting cleaned the fuck out i'm telling you this is a fraud don't go giving nobody your monies and shit like you know what i mean don't allow yourself to get frauded by nobody because this is like getting cleaned the fuck out here robbed even um payback revenge i'm telling you what there's something Oh God. <sighs> but it's a loss. It's mourning a loss. Feeling abandoned, neglected even. Control your anger or you will be sorry. Look at all this Mars energy. Surrender to the divine. Yes. <laughs> But there is, there's period of ill health and depression. This person is like literally down on the floor looking, you know, I mean, pretty down and out to me. Yeah, period of ill health and depression, nine of swords. This is like being haunted. It's a, like a fucking nightmare. Why, why, why? This is a shedding, this tears. This is this great personal sorrow. Um, whew, uh, yeah, let's see here. Six of swords though. So you got the six, the seven of swords and the nine of swords. The six to the seven and the nine. So someone could be planning their escape even. You know what I mean? Um, but the six of swords, hope and wish and praying. It's in the fears, hopes and fears position. But someone definitely going to be leaving, moving, physical location change. It's also this boat here. See this boat? Money or property through an inheritance, winning, or a windfall. Hmm. Announcement with the bell. 
most difficult part of a situation is over. We'll, we'll see, y'all. There goes that money or property through an inheritance, winning, or windfall. So someone may have just like buried into money or something like that. You know, someone definitely invested here. But like I said, this could also be, uh, this is also some kind of inheritance or like life insurance or whatever this is. All right. Um, it's this commitment that we're seeing here, but it's this home, this property, right? Um, family, family with the emperor and the empress, mother, father. This could go so many ways, but the star, a wish will be granted. This is guaranteed success here. The honor and the respect will come to you. Mo money or property through an inheritance, winning or a windfall. Look, you're going to get the boat. You're going to get the house and everything. You know what I mean? Yeah. Interesting. Let's get the clarifiers. Whatever's going on here, though, I mean, this is being taken advantage of. It really is. It's a fucking thief. It's a fucking fraud. Like, literally being, like, cleaned out. No. There goes that judgment, though. Judgment, finalities, closure. You got the judgment here twice. The honor and the respect will come to you. <laughs> Absolutely. All right, some of y'all, there's absolutely been a death, though. I mean, these people are literally the souls leaving that body. And these, you know what I mean? These people are, these souls are come, being called to heaven here. These angels. Some of you guys, you're absolutely being guided by your passed on loved ones here. Ancestors, um, spirit, Archangel Michael, right? Um, Archangel Gabriel. Let's keep going. There goes that Ten of Pentacles. There goes that Ten of Pentacles. Family. Marriage. Commitment. Home. Property. Yeah, this is a marriage. This is all has to do with uh, family here. Whether, you know what I mean? This commitment. That somebody. Man, someone trying to. Man, this is a fraud. It's a thief. It's a cheat. Mourning this loss because some, some, yeah, someone, someone has been being tricky. Empress lovers. Uh oh. Yeah, some of y'all, it was the Empress. It was the wifey. Some of y'all, it's the wifey. Or your person got this person knocked up the mouth going you know what i mean fuck man but this is an unexpected choice in love this is this passion this is this desire someone definitely been treating <sighs> given to two this is this contract but this is also this passion this desire choice in love unexpected choice in love even so some of y'all yeah you're still mourning like the loss of like your husband here because something fucky happened here this is like criminal activity i don't know if someone was selling drugs or doing something you know what i mean illegal i don't know but something happened here or if your person is like an leo like an officer and you know got got killed in the line of duty while dealing with this type of energies, you know, um, maybe you have been still mourning this and spirit is saying you need to, you have this new opportunity for love here. There's a lot of passion and desire. Uh, maybe you're in this place where you feel like you're cheating on your husband, even though he's not, even though he's gone, you know, um, I feel like, cause this is all about accepting and receiving right and opening your arms to receive blessings and i feel like it could be a for those of you who have been mourning a loss for a while you're gonna get your justice um i do believe that and um you may have this new unexpected choice in love here there's a lot of passion chemistry and it can be it really it can be love here 
And Spirit is saying you've been sorry. There's been this sorrow over a loss for a while, this period of ill health and depression, this dissatisfaction with life, right? But Spirit is saying it's time to act now. If you want this happiness with the harp, great happiness and the rainbow, the most difficult part of a situation is over. Okay, I mean, announcement and horseshoe, good luck. So there is, there's gonna be an announcement here. And luck is on your side. Yes, you're being protected. Why? Because you are highly thought of by spirit, the angels, your ancestors, protected from negative forces beyond your control because you are highly thought of. Look at, I mean, you have so much protection here. You have every single angel in the deck here, right? And the star, you're being highly protected. Cobweb, because you're highly thought of, and then key, successful outcome to your problems. You got see key sitting back here? Spirit says you need to act though because there's something going on here. So if you're struggling financially, you hold, you have the key. It's right there. You just need, there, there's a need to act. But I do see this moving and shit too. So if you've been kicked out, if there's something going on here and there's this loss of this marriage and someone got to get the hell out and you're having to be the one couch hopping, you're the one having to stay somewhere, you're the one who had to leave. Um, Spirit is saying you're going to get this key to this home, to this property. You know what I mean? That's what I'm seeing. Got the temperance with the page of swords. <sighs> temperance with the, yeah, you're being protected. You're being guarded here. Yeah. You're being guarded. Okay, this is also all this searching. Searching, searching, looking, looking. In search of what? Peace, balance, harmony? Your other half? I don't know, but this is a searching. But with the temperance. That's interesting. Well, that don't make no damn sense to me. Other than, you know, this is all this. I mean, this is being guarded. It's being protected here. But it's also this searching online. So someone could be sp searching, you know, like spirituality even. Um... interesting there's another card the vulture depression anxiety and worry yeah that someone is working against you because there is <laughs> oh god but you're being protected here absolutely got the six of pentacles to the chariot could be dealing with the cancer sagittarius here gemini um six of pentacles and the chariot i mean the chariot is uh, geared towards success, yes. It's being driven, motivated, um, headed towards success. Someone may have had to, someone may have bought a car recently, purchased a car, had to do some car repairs, um, but headed towards success, receiving something. Time to act because financial punch, but money or property through an inheritance, winning or windfall. So you go, it's like you're going to get the home, the boat, the car, the money, everything. <laughs> the furniture with this old table up here. Damn, yeah, someone's really scared here. This is being wounded though and just needing to surrender, forgive. Get yourself back up, knock your, you know, dust your shoulders off here. Um, but it's being knocked down. It's the wounded warrior. Wounded warrior. I'm telling you, there's something to do with wounded warrior. Elio, military. Um, yeah. 
because if you think about it, and this came up yesterday in one of my readings, and it was it was not one that I posted. It was just one I was uh, I was just pulling cards. But in the in this five of in the original five of pentacles, those people are like on crutches. They're all bandaged up. They're all wounded. Well, it was next to this nine of wands, wounded warrior. But someone, this is like fearful to face judgment, you know, has it, you know, uh, I've, 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 I'm feeling like fearful. This is that uh, worry, anxiety that people are even working against you even, right? Um, but wounded warrior. Sometimes you just have to uh, surrender and release, surrender to the divine and um, know that, that, that spirits got you, yes? Yes. But, but I see someone's like fearful. Fe someone's fearful of, of this judgment. Fearful of taking accountability or whatever. Um, but spirit's saying the honor and respect will come to you. Let's keep going though. Damn. Nine of swords twice. So yeah, someone is. I mean, this is this. I mean, this is a serious depression here. Really mourning a loss. Someone. Uh, I mean, I'm I, I I I'm seeing divorce, man. It's like someone getting uh, God done, thrown out. Moving out. Trash. Trash. Oh, something about the trash. Whew, people are ruthless. All right, let's just keep going because damn. Um, yeah, someone getting tossed out, moved, thrown out, cut off. Yeah, so this is this, I mean, this is a bad state of mind to be in right here. Sorrow over a loss, depression, anxiety, worry that someone is working against you, period of ill health and depression. But spirit saying the most difficult part of a situation is over. You have the deep personal strength and peace that assures success. Some of y'all may need to go on some kind of a vacation, says physically or mentally. Just get the fuck away from it for a while, right? Go to a place of peace, bliss, and get grounded, get balanced out, and, you know... Even if you have to just go for like a country drive or something, you need to get away. Yeah. Um, nine of swords with the four of pentacles. <sighs> Control your anger. You will be sorry. Um, this is a lot to do. Someone is really in a financial pinch and worried. I'm extremely worried. This is in, the, in real serious need of assistance here. Six, the four, five, and the six of pentacles. Financial pinch and worry. <laughs> Sorrow over a loss, a time to act. So I don't know if someone claimed someone out here and they lost everything in a divorce even. And Spirit's saying it's time to act. It's time to act. It's time to rebuild here. Um, I... This can go a couple different ways. Needing to surrender here. Let's see. Fool. Yeah, leaving something all behind. Going on this journey. Going on this trip. Going on this vacation. Whatever it is. But leaving this shit all behind. New beginning. Hey, where's he headed? Do you see that sun there? Headed toward great happiness. Yeah. Someone has got to leave. Literally. Has 
the fool don't take much and it looks like she's only got one bag one suitcase one you know leaving it all behind except for my what i need yes um and i'm headed towards my happiness depression anxiety and worry does she not look worried does she not i mean that girl looks sad that she's you know but look at where you're headed great happiness Yeah, king of wands with the uh, ten of pentacles time to act time to act this is a business owner a leader a boss type of energy but this is this time to act this is also this person who is non-committal and sorrow over a loss ten ton completions tens to the five here someone leaving um announcement good luck you're being protected you're highly thought of and the freaking key moving new home new attitude um i'm telling you there's something to do with this moving and shit money or property through an inheritance winning or windfall though okay it's like you're gonna get You're going to get whatever it is you deserve. Mm -hmm. So twin flame, drama queen, and revenge. Because someone feels threatened by someone's awakening. See, we have this threatened, embarrassed, and then all this ascension. There goes that awakening card that came out in the, in the, in the first, or in the pre-shuffle. This awakening. But embarrassed, threatened, feeling intimidated. So someone feels intimidated by your path. Look at that. Spiritual awakening, sage, ascended, clang, you know what I mean? Healer energy, protected by the divine. You know what I mean? But there's someone here. Look at that. On either side of this twin flame bull shit here. Basically, someone. So if your person is in this situation, it's the karmic, and your y'all person could is could be dealing with with this shit. But ultimately, the honor and respect is going to come to you. Because it's meant to be. But you got somebody, look, on either side of this shit. Look at that. God. Wow. Yeah, there's an enemy afoot trying to come in between, trying to stop a connection here. Because they feel threatened. It's like they know where someone's heart lies. You know, this could go a couple different ways. But this is definitely somebody who's in a situation here. But there's that magnetic pole that, oh no. Someone feels threatened by your... Your light and this connection. It say so if y'all's person is dealing with a karmic third party that they went and got into a situation, that person's becoming privy to it. Maybe your person's not being being quite honest, not you know, with you, with themselves, with this person even. Yeah, it's the masculine. Oh, God. Divine masculine. Grip, anchor, chains, weighed down, under pressure. Rage, about to explode. Control your anger or you will be sorry. Because period of ill health and depression. Legal, court, paperwork, filed. Some kind of legal contract or something that someone got themselves into but you're being protected here spiritual guidance protection from harm being guided by all these angels here towards this new beginning a fresh start you're happy the sun 
love. But man, yeah, someone this there's a masculine here here. It, it, it really under pressure here. Do not control your anger, divine masculine. Two or more people discussing and planning some kind of toxic ass fucking behavior. Look, it's like two or more people discussing and planning how I'm gonna trap a motherfucker up. Oh, pregnancy. What the fuck? Someone may okay. So you're someone may have pretended to be somebody or got their friend or something to create like or to like to reach out online because if someone's online on all these dating sites and shit someone could have set this map i don't i don't know what's going on if this person got set up and you know i i, I don't know but two or more people discussing and planning this toxic ass bullshit revenge hate we see that we see that revenge and the hate why? Because someone feels threatened by this. Can I, I? I just I can't quite put my finger on it, y'all. But there is someone here. Someone got themselves stuck up in some shit, man. And it's almost like it was planned. Like, and I don't know if that shit gets found out. Like, I I don't know. But masculine control your anger, or you will be sorry. Someone is being called to action, called to their purpose even. Yeah, look at what just came out. These cards just been laying here. You're being protected from harm. This connection is being protected. Someone is waking up and the honor and the respect is going to come to you. So some shit may happen, but Spirit is saying, hold, do not be tempted to lower your standards. Just... Because the honor and the respect is going to come to you. However that fits your situation. But I'm telling you what. I feel like that. I It says projected. But I feel like that's protected. I see protected. You are protected. It's all over. The reading. Oh, oh, oh. I just dropped all the cards. But. Uh, judgment. Done. Dead. Yeah. Over. No more passion here. And this is that new beginning, that fresh start. It's passionate. It's just, it, it, you know what I mean? This is also this person who was non-committal. <laughs> if I can play your ass. I don't, I'm telling you what, man. Always on the chase. Distracted for that excitement. Yeah. There goes the emperor again. Very bottom of the deck. Fell out on the floor. So we got an emperor, the ace of cups, two of wands, and the queen of wands. So this is that passion, that desire, that crossroads someone's at. It's a match, king to the queen, emperor, you know, to the feminine, the twin, the one. Yeah, someone dealing with the fucking karmic here. Someone being called to their purpose, though. Someone is being called to their purpose. Mm-hmm. Period of ill health and depression. Pay attention to your, pay attention to your health right now. It's all going to turn around. <laughs> but someone's happiness is, is being affected here. It's being affected. Ooh. Some of y'all, someone from the past watching you. Whatever this person is. Protect your ideas. Shit. Could be a sibling. Hmm. World tower. World tower. Yeah, someone's world getting rocked, but then you go from the Queen of Cups to the Lover, or to the Two of Cups, the Ten of Cups, and the Sun. I mean, that's love. That's happiness. Someone needs to act, though. There may be hard work ahead. Either rebuilding, or putting in effort to fix a situation, or... Um, whatever it is, however it fits your situation. That's what I got though. If you like the video, hit the like button, leave a comment, subscribe, and until tomorrow, love, like, blessings.